Hey YouTube, uh, here is a video about fake, I think fake, although I don't know 100%, uh, Denso Iridium spark plug. Um, but anyways, we got the P0300 code. I checked the engine over. Um, there's nothing wrong and I can't reproduce the code. But in the back of the mind, there's this thing that says, hey, you put fake spark plugs, fake Iridium spark plugs in them. Um, so basically I bought new plugs and the plugs I bought is since NGKs and uh, um, let's see, can you see that? Double platinum, oops, that's not. So the NGK and uh, uh, Denso's seems to be counterfeit. Basically this time I went to O'Reilly's and I got Bosch plugs since they don't seem to be making counterfeits of these. Um, Normally, uh, a random engine misfire um, is a vacuum problem or EGR problem or something that affects the whole engine. It's not really unique to a spark plug. So I think if it was a bad spark plug, I'd get like a P302 or P0302 or 3 or whatever that shows uh, which cylinder has gone bad. So I was thinking that it can't be the spark plugs. But now that I've taken these uh, old fake uh, densels out. I know that these spark plugs are the problem and I'll show you uh, what happened to these spark plugs. So basically before I install a spark plug, let's see can I do this, I will gap them. Um, 0.043 I think is the uh, Prius spec. Uh, my meter is point, my, my gauge is 0.04 and 0.045 so I don't have the 0.043 so basically I say, hey, the 0.04, so I already gapped these uh, Bosch units. So the 0.04 goes through no problem, but the 0.05 doesn't go through, right? That is how I set it because I can't measure any more accurately than that. So with the 0.05, it doesn't go through. 0.04, it goes through. It's a little bit tight here. So basically I say, hey, I'm in the range, I'm okay. And I do this all the time, I change the spark plug, so I know I did it with these Denso units, right? I can't see what I'm doing here. So basically with the Denso plug, I did the same thing and I gapped it, okay? So this is the 0.04, so this I say it'll pass through, this won't pass through is the way I set it up. So the 0.04, let's see will go through and you can see how much gap there is right and the 0.045 and look at how much gap there is so this is how much the tip of the spark plug has burnt off in the last 6500 miles and there's no way this thing's gonna last 150,000 miles like you know a radium plug is supposed to so looking at the tip I don't know how much close-up I could get focus So looking at the tip, this is the um, this is the uh, fake Denso. This is a Bosch that I got. So the iridium tip has a specific shape that's kind of a, a nipple shape or a funnel shape or something like that, um, where it funnels down to a point uh, where I think it's called a wire uh, sticks out. So you can see on the Bosch, you can see it very distinctively. And I remember that the Denso plugs look like this too. But look how the these denso plugs look like. It's just like a round molten metal. Um, <laughs> very funny, right? So basically it's been burning the tip though this is not an iridium. So, and, and of course, I don't know if this is a fake denso. I mean, if somebody could look at it and tell me in the comments, um, you could do that, right? There's, there's more information about the NGKs, but not so much about the Densos. So there's no markings or anything on the, um, the hex part. There's some marking here. Right. I don't have the packaging, but the packaging was the, the red and white uh, Toyota original equipment packaging. So basically what happens is, hey, it's 6,500 miles. <laughs> basically the tip just burnt down 
so uh, I guess even though if I didn't know what miles these plugs were and if I saw this I would have immediately replaced this um, but anyway so this is what happens and I did in my case I did get a P0300 which is a uh, random misfire um, not really sure how worse this could get or whether it'll eventually burn a, a hole through the cylinder head or anything like that but um, so if you did put in a very very cheap Denso or NGK plugs um, you might want to revisit it and take a look at it to see what it looks like now uh, before uh, it stalls and um, the car stalls and leaves you stranded on the side of the road but uh, here again This in. Yeah, here it is. is the difference in the tip again this is this is the uh, uh, fake denso or what I think is fake and this is what a Bosch unit or what normal iridium tips should look like okay there it is goodbye